You cannot and will not see them approach and hook onto you with their many-armed apparatus, the tentacles with teeth at their ends, the teeth that puncture and suck. They are vampires, cannibals, and devils. I must watch out for them, for surely sleeping in their midst signifies my retreat and defeat. Will my super suit of shit, piss, and blood protect me from the icy flames of the demon inferno or the countless lashes, gashes, and stings that I will surely suffer in my quest to subdue the beast? Before I let his vast influence and trickery defeat my purpose, I toss him into the heart of my pennant like a match onto a pool of gasoline, and it becomes a lake of fire. You, like, you've watched a lot of science fiction and horror and... I did, I did devour a lot of science fiction as a child. Um, you think that any of that contributed to any kind of symptoms that you experienced later in life? You know, just kind of fed your mind with... Well, when I get delusional, it, it gets pretty sci-fi. It gets pretty sci-fi. <laughs> It's Jesus comes back and he's got a blue spangled, you know, super suit, and you know, and his supervillains are all just off the charts. Yeah, it, it's definitely, uh, yeah, it definitely fed a lot of that stuff. You know.